Cobra a beer. Back in 1986, it was a small town in the Urals, where beer was not often in the shops, and we had just been discharged from the ranks of the valiant Soviet army. By law, after the army, you can rest for three months, the beginning of summer, warm. We gathered at a friend's house, we sit and decide what we will do today. I don't remember who says, so the beer was delivered to the local store, let's buy a beer. There were about six of us, we collected a decent amount of money, there are enough liters for 30 draft. They sent me and a friend to the store, but there is no suitable container. We go to the owner, give them a container, and he does not have a container, there is only a flask of aluminum for 40 liters. Okay, we think it'll do. And so we go with the two of us to the store, carrying a flask. And the first three or four days after demobilization in the shape, but not in parade, and CG Red, was in the Soviet army form such, stitched on a figure, a bullets on the overcoat thick, the chevron on the sleeve, a cap with a blue band, aviation, boots accordion. They came to the store, I said to a friend, you wait with a flask at the entrance, and I'll take the queue, as soon as I call. The queue of men with 3 liter cans is 12, 15 people. Well, I stood up so modestly at the end. The men looked at me with a frown and one of them said, what are you doing here? Well, I drank beer is now the one in trouble, and meat like beer you want, and this guy yells to the seller, Rita let go of the soldier without a cue, and adds, I think the others don't mind. All the men cheered and began to push me to the counter. The seller asks, where is the container? I turn around and shout, Sarioga, come here. Here the people also need, here they say with what it is necessary to go for beer, and we say with cans. It was a good beer, alive. Even on the second day, there wasn't much left. <laughs>